needed to take a test to see if any of us had a kidney good enough for my brother. Found out something interesting. They ain't my kids. Now, this may be karma because I'm sure he probably said, well, guess what? I know it ain't your child, but you're going to pay for it anyway. Mm. Child support. Nullified. You got to pay, God damn it. Child support? <laughs> mm. That is fucked. That is fucked. After 51 years. Well, I am not honeybee. I said I'm honey dip. Make sure you clear. It's honey dip. Yeah, I, honey dip. Oh, oh, it's in the building. <laughs> I'm in class with my man, El Plaga. Hey, welcome. Yeah. Then we're going to get some class from my man, Ubu. You know Shout man? out. Get some class from my man, Ubu, up in the building. There we go. God damn. There we go. We appreciate the yeah. love. Right? That's right. It, it's, because of, it's because of those guys. It's the reason why this joint is growing. Exactly. We love y'all. Yeah, I mean. So we slide to video number two. Yep. Number two, let's go. All right. Oh. Video number two. After 51, 51 years of marriage, this judge learns that his children aren't his. <laughs> I, you know what? And, but you know what? Oh, let's, go. Well, let's go. It's this jump podcast. Aww. Let's go. I have been married for 51 years. Got two sons, 42 and 40, damn deadbeats. I'm still supporting the little boogers. Needed to take a test to see if any of us had a kidney good enough for my brother. Found out something interesting. They ain't my kids. There's somebody else's. Of course, the only good thing is, I know it's not my fault that those two idiots got dumped into this world. Hell, I thought they took after their mother. Instead, they take after the plumber or the postman or the milkman or, yeah, they were milkmen back when they came around. I mean, God only knows. It sure gets old. I do wish I knew who the real fathers were. And they ain't the same. She was bopping a couple of different guys. But if I could figure out who they were, I've been practicing law, law long enough that I pretty well figure I could sue their ass and get all my money back that I sunk into those two dead meat. It just chaps my ass that she couldn't tell me I'd probably forgiven her maybe not you know how it is hell yeah, boys y'all need to go get your own paternity test you can't tell how by looking who's the daddy unless you're looking down at the genetic level I've been in court thousands of times in paternity suits at four out of five times. Guy says he ain't the daddy, he's right. And the genetic test are the only way to prove it for sure. These women are hopping everything that looks fun. You thought you liked sex. <laughs> you ain't nothing. Well, I guess that pretty well completes that story. I'll go home, start drafting up some divorce papers, see if I can't get free of that crazy bitch. I mean, I stayed with her for the sake of the children and the grandchildren, now the great-grandchildren. They ain't no kin of mine. Fuck 'em. 
you know, I I, I, I want to say this. I want to say this. All right, Agatha, you're the judge. Now, this, now this may be karma because I'm sure he probably said, "Well, guess what." I know it ain't your child, but you're going to pay for it anyway. Mm. Child support nullified. You got to pay, God damn it. Child support <laughs> granted. Mm. That is fucked. That is fucked. After 51 years, Let's she lived with that the, shit. Like I said, anybody that I know that's a male and they've already had like some kind of inclination that, wait a minute, that child ain't mine. Agatha. I'm pretty mm-hmm. sure he had the same idea somewhere along the line, not just now, and they forced. 42 years old nor did he, what you're saying is that in the back of his mind he knew that those two boys wasn't his it he sounds chose, like chose he ignore. was with his career sad okay. to Damn, say we just jumped into conclusions on man <laughs> because he said it he said he wasn't home the wife was doing whatever, whatever with whoever he he said it that she she had multiple people so at some point he had to have known she was fucking cheating agatha edith costanza so i guess with him because he's a judge and he's like you know when you go when you go into law school that takes a lot of time that's a lot of years so he was focused sad to say that he this is how he paid See, for fellas, it that's why you just be a bum okay this is the reason why we are bums today not we because i'm not me but this is why there are bums out there because you go out there you work hard you make it all the way to judge and you find out that your two goddamn kids is not even yours because agatha was out there slaying that cat at the cotton club down there with red fox in them so now see what i'm saying just be a bum that situation fact, does not steadman. apply to everybody don't be a bum be steadman Okay, get you an Oprah. Don't, don't say shit. Don't, don't, don't be all in the camera dancing. Just be in the background. Be like Stem and live a good life, okay? First of all, get you some Viagra, cho- choose, some libido choose pill. Real, choose a real woman and you won't have that problem. Mm-mm. We can't How tell. About that? We can't tell. 42 years. But no, she wasn't no real woman. <clears throat> but let me, I mean, yes, how, I mean, how could you? Ain't no way in hell you can't tell like when that. somebody. <laughs> because sometimes, you know. A lot of times, I guess people just settle in life. It's like okay with him. It's like okay. But how do you? You can feel it. Ooh, you can tell. But how when, do you really you can know? Tell when your partner is cheating. You can tell, I mean, can you really tell? No, I, no, I don't know. I, I'm, I, I can't speak for your males. So you know how they call it women's intu- intuition. I know majority of the women that I know. Men are cheating, but they don't know when they're bums. I'm confused. <laughs> I'm just saying, if it's intuition, you only but get they, don't, listen, they women, only get cheating intuition. Listen, they don't listen, get bum intuition. Listen, <laughs> listen, women. First of all, I don't. Men are cheating because of women intuition, but they never know when their man is unhappy or a bum. <laughs> Ooh, give me that right there, bro. Take the sweat off. <laughs> and smack both of y'all. <laughs> we on fire tonight. Toe, please. <laughs> oh, but I mean, as I, I feel for him, but I don't feel for him. Because you cannot tell me, man, after 51 years of marriage, you don't know when this woman stepped out on you yeah, he or, or even oh, had yeah, that had knew. that feeling like, I think someone stretched your coochie. This is my thing, though. I'm going a, I'm to a play devil's advocate for Paul. In today's generation, where the, the new newer generation is like, up, oh, yeah, you did one thing, I'm out. And so they are, they try to compl- they try to say like this new generation they give up too easy. Yeah, so I believe that. For him, he's probably where even if she did step out, you know that they from that generation will work it out. Now yeah. again, I'm not saying that you should keep a woman that had kids by another man. Ooh. So he could have been like, you know what, you you stepped out. All right, cool. And again, DNA and all that wasn't a thing back 40 years ago. So they ain't, he probably ain't really was checking for that. So, yeah, but at some point, your one of your children or if. Both of your children got to have something, not necessarily everything like you, but something is going to be like, oh, okay, yeah, they take after me. Okay, oh, yeah, you know what? I used to do that when I was young at some point. But but these two kids and there's nothing. Like, come on, really? (laughs) Like, like no trace. Nothing. They might have had that. He he, might Because he said, he thought that part of it. I need to lie on both my son. Look like me. They don't have Oh, come on, you you got that partner. Because that ain't me. (laughs) Here it is. Look, the fucking pool boy is a mandingo. (laughs) No, it wasn't him. (laughs) But, you know, I want to ask because, you know, I can't ask you this. But, CJ, as a man, what would you do, dog, if you found out that (laughs) both your children aren't yours after 51 years? I am going to Agatha and say, listen here, you dirty bitch. (laughs) You knew this the whole time. Well, guess what? From here on out, I'm gonna keep you on a life insurance because mm. when you die, I'm getting, I'm getting some, I'm getting paid for this. But for now, don't ask me a goddamn thing, okay? 
I'm I, going down there to that place. Uh, yeah. they, they, I heard it's in Atlanta. It's called Magic City. Oh. Okay. I'm going down there. To get my back rubbed and my balls tugged. <laughs> I don't want to hear a goddamn word from you. Okay? And I heard and something called the Freak Nick Flex. Tell her to, I'm right, going to see what? if they, we can you recreate gotta, that. You and he go said live, he ain't You got to go live in the guest house. Guest house. That's I, just, no, you can have a main house. <laughs> but I'm going to bring a lot of guests <laughs> up in this main house. <laughs> listen, listen. I, I believe what, what U said. I think he knew, but was in denial. Yeah, he, he, knew. he knew. He knew. I don't know, Paul. But, but, were, but I'm about to ask a woman here. Why do some women cheat and then still stay with the man after they cheated? Probably for the benefit. Yeah, that's most of the time what it is. Yeah, the that's benefit. most of the time what it is. Because hey. it's like, oh, if she's staying with him, it's for, number one, whatever benefits, financial or whatever that she's getting, and the security. The security mm, yeah, of she, knowing that, okay. okay, you know what? He's a good man or whatever, but he's just, he checks off all my boxes, but just the one physically. But, dry, but dropping yeah. dick off Wait Danny or oh, yeah. That's what I'm just he saying. Only a, he only so, give her 15 strokes. Right. <laughs> he, he dropping that dick off. <laughs>